Ryan, you've been at Sporting in Portugal for roughly 18 months now. How are you finding life? Um, I'm really enjoying it. Um, obviously still playing in the B team, um, which I'm enjoying. I'm still getting good experience from all the games. and We'd been on a bit of a bad run, um, but we picked up again lately. And Yesterday was, I think it was our best win of the season. We won 5-0 against bottom of the table, but you know, you take a 5-0 win all the time. With Andy Robertson cementing a place in the A squad and, and more recently John McGinn from the under-21s, is it encouraging to see that? Yeah, I'd say so because it's it's not just like Andy and uh, John, it's Callum Patterson's been there before, Lewis McLeod's been, Stevie May got called up, I was there myself. Um, so yeah, it's, it's good to um, see that all the work that all the boys in this team's doing is is getting recognised and um, that Gordon Strachan's, you know, he's willing to give anyone a chance. The last game against France uh, didn't quite go to plan um, with the red card and, and the loss. How desperate are you to make amends on Thursday night? Yeah, I would I would say, obviously, personally, um, I was really disappointed after what happened in the last France game, but uh, I would say it's more of thinking on a, a team level for this next game. Um, you know, it's a game that we kind of have to we have to take something from it because we're kind of struggling just now in the group. We're a little bit behind, so we need to start getting points. And uh, if I could help the team out with a goal or something, then obviously that would make a little bit of amends for what happened in the last game. So hopefully it could go something like that.